Uh, for those of you who don't know what water baptism is, it's for those who have given their life to Christ and they want to make it known to the world. It's a public declaration of an inward decision. And today we have six wonderful people who are going to get baptized. So let's put our hands together for those six people today. And right now, if we could, uh, we could play the first clip. Hi, my name is Zachary Velasquez. And I am getting baptized today because I am following Jesus. Before my life, before I was saved, my life was filled with turmoil and I was going through a lot and I was feeling alone, but I was never really alone. I was delivered at the Hungry Generation Church with the spirit that was turmoiling in my life. And now everything has changed. I'm not an angry person. I'm happier. I'm happy with myself. I love myself and I love Jesus and I thank him every day for changing my life. Today I'm getting baptized because I want the world to know that I'm following Jesus. <laughs> Amen. Let's put our hands together. All right, Zach, do you believe in Jesus Christ as God's son and your personal Lord and Savior? Yes. And do you promise to follow him with good and clear conscience for the rest of your life? Yes. Based on your faith, your confession, and your commitment, we'll baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. and my life before Christ was terrible. I was such an impatient person, full of anger. I took it out on everybody. The first time I felt Jesus' presence was here in this church, Hungry Gen. I was saved and delivered on January 31st, 2017. And now my life is better. I'm more patient. I'm happier. Today I'm getting baptized because I want the world to know of my decision to follow Jesus. Aurelia, do you believe in Jesus Christ as God's son and your personal Lord and Savior? Yes, I do. And do you promise to follow him with good and clear conscience for the rest of your life? Yes, I do. Based on your faith, your confession, and your commitment, we'll baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Hello, my name is Hannah Lozano. I'm from Pasco, Washington. Um, my life before Christ was way more like different. Um, I didn't, I wasn't really close to Christ, but since I came to Hunger Gen, my life has changed more. And since I gave my life to Christ, I didn't really um, focus on Jesus or church. But since I started coming here, I started to like it more and um, pray more and and um, notice Jesus more and talk to him more. I want the world to know that I decided to follow Jesus. Hannah, how old are you? 11. 11. Come on, let's put our hands together. She's 11 years old. She's getting baptized. She's made the decision to follow Jesus with all her life. Amen? Amen. So, uh, Hannah, do you believe in Jesus Christ as God's son and your personal Lord and sa your Savior? Yes. And do you promise to follow him with good and clear conscience for the rest of your life? Yes. Based on your faith, your confession, and your commitment, we'll baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. came to God and before I was walking with God, I would say was very closed off and very um, controlled and limited and I just basically let a lot of anxiety and fear just control um, everything that I did on a daily basis. And um, since I've come to walk closely with God, I just have a peace that I didn't have before. Um, he's also showed me that his love is greater than anything that I'll face in life. And that I don't have to fear and I don't have to be afraid about anything that will come up because he already has the answer already figured out. So the first time that I came to Hungry Gen was actually um, with my mom because my family comes here. And um, I just really felt called to, um, and pulled to come to this church and call it my home church because I love the boldness and I love the passion that I see at, at this church. And 
um, that I just see the church overall as a body just pursuing the kingdom with just passion and confidence. And so, um, yeah, that's my story. <laughs> Today I'm getting baptized because I want the world to know about my decision to follow Jesus. So Megan, do you believe in Jesus Christ as God's son and your personal Lord and Savior? I do. And do you promise to follow him with good and clear conscience for the rest of your life? Yes. Based on your faith, your confession, your commitment, we'll baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. So my life before I knew Christ, um, or had a relationship with Christ, I was living sinfully and I was... I was depressed and I was fearful of a lot of things and I, I, did, I did drugs. I, um, I wasn't living the way I should be and Christ was speaking through someone and I didn't realize that he was trying to let me hear him until I knew it in my heart that that was him, that he was trying to save me from living the way I was. and. That very day, the day I felt um, that God wanted to save me, um, I asked my friend Yaklin um, if I could come to this church. And so the next day I came and God just spoke to me the whole time through the messages and every day since then that I felt saved. God has just been speaking more and more to me and I just, I want more and more of him. And I've never experienced that before when I thought I was a Christian. Uh, it was like I just knew about him, but I didn't know him. Today I'm getting baptized because I want the world to know my relationship with Jesus. So, Jamira, do you believe in Jesus Christ as God's son and your personal Lord and Savior? Yes. And do you promise to follow him with good and clear conscience for the rest of your life? Yes. Based on your faith, your confession, and your commitment, we'll baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. I'm Foster uh, Davey, and uh, my life before Christ was kind of, I was going through a really hard time. Uh, I was always depressed, um, just didn't really have anything going for me. Everything that could go wrong went wrong, and I just didn't really have a thing go, uh, really going for me, and just recently I just decided to kind of put God instead of at the middle, at the top. And it really, it's changed my life. Um, about, and it's about, been about two weeks now. I already got a call for another job in the interview. Um, and I was, I was praying on these things before, but it wasn't, nothing was really coming through until, until I fully gave to God. I'm <clears throat> ready to show the world that I'm ready to dedicate myself to Jesus Christ, my savior. All right, Foster, do you believe in Jesus Christ as God's son and your personal Lord and Savior? Yes, I do. And do you promise to follow him with good and clear conscience for the rest of your life? Of course. Based on your faith, your confession, and commitment, we'll baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. 